He was an American music executive, businessman, and film producer, who also went by the name Black Godfather. His family. His daughter. Daughter name Nicole Owen. His spouse. Spouse name Jacqueline. A spouse was fatally shot by an intruder who entered the Beverly Hills home on December first, two thousand twenty-one. His son. Son name Alexander. son in law son in law ted his family he had four younger brothers and three younger sisters his lifestyle he had an estimated net worth of 50 million dollars his childhood young age he was born in the climax north carolina us he was born on feb 25 1931 he was the oldest of eight children He attended a one-room school in the Greensboro, North Carolina, until the eighth grade. His house and car. An aerial view of Beverly Hills home of the Clarence and Jacqueline. He lived in the Beverly Hills. This is one of the California's most prominent place to reside an extraordinary life. A former convict has pled guilty to the Beverly Hills home invasion. He spent his freshman and second year of high school at the Dudley High School in Greensboro. before moving to new jersey in 1947 as a teenager before and after in new jersey he worked as a stock clerk at the macy's and for a law directory he began in the music business in the 1950s as a manager of the Teddy Peace Lounge in Newark, New Jersey, owned by the promoter Teddy Powell. Memory with his wife. In 1967, he married Jacqueline His wife was also on the board of director of the International Student Center at the UCLA. She was shot and killed on the December 1st, 2021 at the age of 81 during a home invasion at the couple's residence in the Beverly Hills, California. His award collection His 75th birthday was celebrated by the Billboard in its february 2006 issue he later managed r&b singer little billy jazz singer sara kim weston louis bonpa wayton eddy etc his work 
he moved from the Manhattan to Beverly Hills to work with the Venture Records. He received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame for his contribution in the recording industry. His old memories. In Feb 2018, he received the Presidential Merit Award as a Grammy icon at the Clive Davis Free Grammy Gala in Los Angeles. On May 12, 2021, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame announced that Avant received the Ahmed Artigan Award and will be inducted to 2021 class. In 1973, Paramount Picture release Save the Children with the event serving as an executive producer. He died at his home in Los Angeles on August 13, 2023 at the age of 92.